Figma versus Canva. Which design tool is right for you? Hey everyone, welcome back to Shift's App Spotlight, your go-to for the best apps to simplify your online life and in today's case, streamline creative projects. Today we're comparing two design powerhouses, Figma and Canva. Whether you're a seasoned designer or just starting out, we'll break down the benefits and drawbacks of each so you can choose the one that fits your needs. Let's jump in. First up is Figma, a cloud-based tool revolutionizing design collaboration. Figma is perfect for professional designers and teams, especially for UI UX projects. Its biggest strength, real-time collaboration. Imagine your team working on the same project simultaneously. No more back and forth, passive aggressive Slack messages. Plus, since it's browser based, Figma runs on any operating system, letting you design from anywhere. Figma's other standout features include component libraries so you can reuse design elements and keep branding consistent, and interactive prototyping so you can test designs before anyone writes a line of code. Figma also offers version control, making it easy to track changes and revert if needed. Trust me, this is a lifesaver when an idea that seemed brilliant in your head doesn't quite land on the screen. However, Figma's advanced features come with a learning curve, and while there's a free plan, unlocking its full capabilities requires a paid subscription. Next up is Canva, a fan favorite for anyone who needs quick, beautiful designs without the complexity. Canva's drag and drop interface and vast template library makes creating visuals incredibly easy, even if you're new to design. Canva shines in ease of use. It's loaded with templates for social media, presentations, logos, proposals and more, along with millions of royalty-free photos, illustrations and fonts. You can finally avoid the scavenger hunt for non-cheesy stock images. Canva also includes a brand kit, which helps you manage colors, logos and fonts all in one place so your designs stay on brand. And yes, there's some collaboration capability here, though it doesn't offer the real-time magic that Figma does. While Canva's great for simple, fast designs, it lacks some of Figma's advanced tools, making it less suitable for detailed interactive projects. And because templates can be a bit restrictive, Canva is not always ideal if you're after complete customization. Figma versus Canva, the comparison. So which one's right for you? If you're a professional designer working on complex UI UX projects, Figma's your go-to. But if you're a beginner or need something quick and visually appealing, Canva's your best friend. And remember, you can manage both Figma and Canva along with all your other apps within Shift Browser. Imagine having all your design tools at your fingertips, so no more playing the very fun game of where did my tab go, while you're deep in the creative zone. With Shift, you can jump between all your design tools, pull assets from one tool to another, and keep your creative flow uninterrupted. Thanks for tuning into Shift's app Spotlight. If this was helpful, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more app comparisons. Let us know in the comments, are you Team Figma, Team Canva, or both? See you next time.